Prince Harry's first appearance of the year has been confirmed as the Duke prepares to discuss a cause close to his and Meghan's hearts next month. On February 3rd, the Duke of Sussex, 37, will be taking part in a virtual event with BetterUp, a mental health startup founded in 2013. The San Francisco-based startup offers professional and personal coaching through its mobile app to help people live more meaningful, vibrant lives with greater clarity, purpose, and passion. Harry was hired by The Body last year, and works as a chief impact officer. For February's event, Harry will join forces with BetterUp's co-founder and CEO Alexi Robico and the pair will discuss their bold commitment to the company's inner work initiative. While the full agenda of the day has yet to be released, the virtual event is expected to involve a host of guest speakers. These include Jacinta Jimenez, BetterUp's VP of Coach Innovation and a trained psychologist, and Mercedes Valencia, a self-love expert. In a tweet, the company described the term inner work as a mindful, conscious effort to organize the inner you, your thoughts and reactions, your feelings and instincts. BetterUp explained this could involve engaging in activities that recharge, re-inspire, and reignite your sense of purpose and that it refers to work dedicated to ordering your mind. Registration for the event is free, and many Prince Harry fans shared their enthusiasm about the Duke's next appearance and have already registered their attendance. User Gabriel and I wrote, can't wait to see Prince Harry. A lovely and honorable man. While another added the working prince. Proud of you H. A third, Daisy Hart wrote, Gosh, I can't wait for this. I'll be registering and listening intently to all these incredible speakers especially the Chief Impact Officer Prince Harry Better Up 1 ST Annual Inner Work Day. Harry delved into what his role at the company involves during an interview with the American business magazine Fast Company last year. While no explicit details of his day-to-day -day were given, in a foreword, the magazine explains Harry's role spans product strategy, philanthropy, and public advocacy related to mental health. Mr. Robico added, part of his role is using his voice, experience, and background for advocacy and leadership around mental health. Mental health is a cause close to the hearts of both Harry and his wife Meghan Markle, 40, and the pair have both opened up about their own mental health struggles in the past. Harry, in particular, has spoken about the impact of grief, and the impact the death of his mother Princess Diana had on his life. While Meghan shared she had experienced suicidal thoughts while pregnant with her first child Archie, during a tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey last March, also during the Apple TV Plus docuseries, The Me You Can't See, Harry said he and Meghan chose to put our mental health first when exiting the royal family. The Duke also credited therapy for why he and Meghan are in a better place today. 2022 is also set to be an exciting year of Harry because the Invictus Games, which he founded, is due to return after it had been postponed twice due to the pandemic. The international sporting event for wounded, injured and sick servicemen and women, both serving and veterans will take place from 16 to 22 April at the Geoda Park in The Hague. The inaugural games were held in London and since then has been held in Orlando in 2016, Toronto in 2017 and Sydney in 2018. This year Harry and Meghan will also celebrate their daughter Lilibet's first birthday in June.